Okay guys, this is Let's Play Pokemon Crystal Part 3. And I was walking back to deliver the egg when I ran into this guy. You got a Pokemon lab? What a waste. I went like you. Don't you get what I'm saying? Well, I too have a good one. I'll show you what I mean. Let's battle it out. Whoa, that was cool. How we were standing like a Pokemon ball box. Question mark, question mark, question mark wants to battle. What kind of name is that? That's a messed up name. Question mark, question mark, question mark. Totodile. He's gonna kill me. I have a fire type. Unless he doesn't know any water moves yet, I'm dead. I'll just use tackle. I hope he doesn't know any water moves. Oh, thank goodness. I still have a chance of winning. Oh, he knows Scratch. That doesn't hurt. So I'll just keep using Tackle. I think this is either my worst enemy that he's... Or this guy. He's either my worst. He's either my friend, my rival, or an evil dude who stole this Pokemon. I guess I'll find out. I think he's the guy who stole the Pokemon. That's why Oak called earlier. That makes so much sense. Question mark was defeated. Hmm, are you happy you won? My name's. I'm going to be the world's greatest Pokemon trainer. Dude, you're messed up. I'll ignore that. While I walk back. I'll just keep walking back. And that guy was really weird. I just gotta go deliver this egg to Oak so I can be a good citizen. And I always jump over the edges though because there's no point in going through the wild grass. This takes too long. Yeah. Okay, I heard you had a disaster. I'm here to deliver the egg. I heard a Pokemon was stolen. I saw the guy who stole it. I saw that guy. You battled a trainer like that? Did you happen to get his name? His name is going to be... Batty. Yep, that's a great name. Okay, so Batty was his name. Thanks for helping in the investigation. This is terrible. Oh yes, it was, that was Mr. Pokemon's big discovery. Ash handed the mysterious egg to the Professor Elm. This? What? It's a Pokemon egg. If it is, it is a great discovery. What? Professor Oak gave you a Pokedex? Is that true? That's incredible. He's superb at seeing the potential of people as trainers. Wow, Ash, you may have what it takes to become the best Pokemon Master in the whole entire world and become the ultimate champion that everyone is jealous of. Is what he was gonna say, but I just implied it for him, so. Violet City? I was just about to go there. I guess I get to go to a gym now. Now I gotta go talk to my mom. Ash, use these on your quest. Yes, I always wanted one of those. Now I can catch Pokemon. I just throw it wild Pokemon and I can catch him now. Just gotta leave here. Go talk to my mom. Where's my mom at? Oh, there she is. Wow, that's a cute Pokemon. Where'd you get it? So, you're leaving on an adventure? Okay, I'll help too, but what can I do for you? I know, I'll save money for you. On a long journey, money's important. Do you want me to save your money? What? I don't want you to save my money. I, I said never mind. I'm behind you all the way.
I don't want you to save my money, Mom. No! Can I undo that mistake? I heard Elm discovered some new Pokemon. Cool, but I want my mom to not save my money anymore. She will ruin it. I see. I've kept your room tidy, or is this about your money? Yes, it is. What do you want to do? Change. Oh, no! I don't want you to stay with... Oh, I meant to do this again. I'm just gonna pause while I do this. Okay, so my mom is no longer saving my money, which is a good thing. I have to go back to Violet City for the first gym, and on the way I will catch some Pokemon. Oh, I'm getting battled. I've seen you a couple times. Many Pokemon have been caught. Would you like me to show you how to catch them? No, thanks. But yes, anyways, I don't know why. You might give me some reward for watching or something. I'll just... I'll let you guys learn an educational thing, too. That's just awesome. He's not even attacking, and somehow he catches it. And he has a weird name, dude. How does this even happen? He caught it without even doing anything. That's just awesome. That's how you do it. If you weaken them first, they're easier. Oh, you didn't give me a reward? You're mean. I'm foreverly hating you now. Who do I get to catch this time? Oh, uh, I don't know if I really want to catch a red attack. No, he's too weak. I don't want to catch him. I'll just run. I'm on my way to becoming a master. This is- Oh, I'm going the wrong way. I'm still going the wrong way. I have to go up by this little ledge. And I have to walk through the tall grass again. But I got there safely somehow. Oh, I didn't mean to do that, but I guess it doesn't really matter. And I also didn't mean to do- Actually, I did mean to do that, so it does matter. I'm just gonna fast forward till I get to Vi Violet City. I'm like gonna meet you there. Okay, it's time to make this epic journey while I get battled, challenged by people to battle them. See? Okay, he's gonna challenge me. Yes! Dude, bring it on. See, he's challenged. He said I look weak. He's gonna die for that. How could he say I look weak? He's going down just for saying that horrible thing. Youngster Jelly wants to battle. Ratata. Go Cyndaquil. You're gonna kill him by using tackle. Wow, he's almost dead. I'm gonna go up to like level 9 already. Level 9. What? Oh, never mind, I missed. Of course. After this battle, I'm gonna end the video on a happy note, not a sad one, so that's why I have to win. Yes, I have accomplished the task successfully. And I'm level 9. Youngster Joey was defeated. Ack, I lost again, doggone it. Man, he was sad. Oh, I can't battle him. I have to end it on a happy note. I will end it by looking and bolt, doing my four-way, looking, my spinning dance move. Yeah. See, watch that. Oh yeah, it's so awesome. Okay, well that's the end of part three. Hope you enjoyed the rest of the parts, and remember to subscribe for all these great videos, and that's the end.